Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another Decaroo cube. Let's try to open some power here. Just kidding, there's no power to be had. However, we can still open some good stuff. So, uh, for those watching on YouTube or Twitch, since you can watch Amazon Prime videos on Twitch now, because Twitch owns Amazon, so that makes a lot of sense, um, we were thinking of watching The Lighthouse this weekend on stream. So, if anyone's interested, definitely follow or subscribe. You can get notifications when you go live. And uh, I think that'd be pretty cool. We can all just hang out during quarantine can pop the subtitles on so you can still hear it over us chatting. Do you have a time roughly? Literally, no. <laughs> Literally. Antibody, you, we, you watched us make the plans on the stream. What is this? Two out of eight. Let's go. Come on. All right, guys, I unpaused it, and now we're getting to it. Dang it. Do you want Kefnet? Kefnet seems very, very good. Here's Downfall. I like Nightpack Ambusher, too, if there's, like, a instant speed deck. Nightpack Ambusher is real strong. It's better than Kefnet? I don't know. I don't know. Ooh, what's this? There's, like, this hair floof here that's, that's doing its own thing. Can't really see it, but now you're leaving. Yeah, Utah was only a temporary solution. My my lease ended in January, and Katie's lease ended in June. So I needed a place to live between January and June. So my friend Jake, otherwise known as Spectral Links in the chat, was like, "Hey, um, I gotta, I gotta, I got some extra space for you if you want to move here." And I was like, "Okay, cool." So moved here, and uh, then me and Katie will be getting our place and. Do you read books, etc. much? I mean, I try to. I'm more of like I'm more of like a video content digester though. Like I love books and I love reading, but I'm gonna try Nightpack Ambusher. I like it too much. Um, but I feel like before bed I'll just like consume like you know, 10, 15 minute YouTube videos. Condescend. Do we believe the same deck? Plow under is pretty good. I do like Condescend. We just play instant speed stuff. I also like Nimble Obstructionist. Hmm. Oh, you thought the move was because Mike, like, no, Mike got a job here and gave up a, a job that paid him like $6 more an hour in Florida. <laughs> Like, we would never move to Utah specifically because he got, like, a $10, a $12 an hour call center job. That would be wild. I don't know what's going on. This is a fucking weirdo in chat, man. Uh, I'm going to just take Condescend again. I think it's very good. And if we want to be Nightpack ambushing, I think that's fine. Impulse seems good, too. Uh... Exclusion Mage is alright. Oh, Antibody, I, I got you. I got you. Appreciate it, buddy. I appreciate it. Um, Alright, so we're out of... Oh, I like Crashing Footfalls. Let's just try Crashing Footfalls here. Two green four forwards. The problem is... So here's the thing about Crashing Footfalls, right? Um, when you suspend a creature and it comes into play, the creature has haste. When you suspend a card like Crashing Footfalls and it makes two tokens, the tokens don't have haste. So. Just a little, little thing. Hmm. 
Yeah, my coast seems pretty good, dude. Into the Royal's nice. Muldrifter's fantastic, but I think I'd rather fix my mana. Spell Pierce? Sure. <clears throat> I'm just going mono. Wretched Confluence is super nice. I wonder if Mystic Confluence is also in the cube. <coughs> spell costs one less for each attacking creature. Oh, and it has Flash? That's actually pretty interesting. Oh, wow. I kind of like this in our deck. That's kind of wild. Oh, yeah. That's pretty wild. I'm taking that for sure. Eh, Warcraft Water is 2 for 2. Eh, it doesn't have flash. Wild growth is probably better here. It's kind of ramp. I wish they didn't use the white bordered one, but you know, whatever. And nothing for us, unfortunately. What is the treasure chest? On Magic Online, it just means you find it in a treasure chest. But often it's from uh, commander sets or plane chase sets or things like that. Things of that nature. God, no, no bluer. Green cards whatsoever. I'm going to take Zealous Conscripts because it's just <laughs> it absolutely shouldn't still be in that pack. I've been playing for 25 years. Uh, okay. I mean, geez, they're giving us really good red cards. Blade is very good. It doesn't seem that great because it has to be the same creature type. And like right now we have Gollum, Wolf, that's it. We have two creatures. Let's twist again. Mine, mine will be so nice. All right, well, these are a good seven. Oh, Hydroid Crassis. Crassis. Uh, it's probably just Hydroid Crassus, right? There's like no instance in this pack. Arborough's actually not terrible. I think Crassus has a much higher power level. I'm going to take the Hydroid Crassis. Crassis. Oh, a Pact of Negation and a Misty Rainforest. Ooh, I think we take Misty here. Hope to get a Breeding Pool. Also, Pact of Negation is pretty good. Yeah, I'm going to take the Pact of Negation. It just wrecks people. Oh, I see what you're doing to me right now. Ugh. I think 
we're just taking chemistry's insight and I don't like it. Is there Narset in the cube? We have no black fixing. We have no any fixing right now, I guess. Oh, God. Okay. Okay. Oh, Factor Fiction? Well, that's that's nice because you just passed Chemister's Insight, so... I'm going to take Factor over Ponder because we have Nightpack Ambusher and we're trying to do flashy things. Draw a Tree Speaker seems great. Huh. Yeah, all right. I'll take a Draw a Tree Speaker. Sure. I don't know what's going on here. This deck is... It's kind of all over the place, but it's also not terrible. <laughs> Excuse me. Mystic Snake. Now you're talking my language. This guy's going to go over here for now unless we can fix it. <coughs> really don't want to be paying like anything more than six mana for this guy. Although a 12-12 for six is a pretty good deal. Plus when he dies, like, makes another thing. Chase Wilder of Mysteries. Yeah, let's do that. I'm going to be unhelpful and say you should just imagine dancing horse fingers until you get tired and fall asleep. I have never seen a horse finger before. Uh, I like this better than cord. I think cord is generally a little expensive, but sensor can just get them. Like we did last summer. Let's twist again. Like we did last year. <laughs> Devoted Druid? Also, Cultivator's Caravan. I think you like Druid because it just ramps us into the four drops, which is nice. Cultivator's Caravan ramps us into, like, nothing else, so. Demir Seeker. Actually, Boon is a flash creature. I think Demir's Signet's just a better card, and it gives us incentive to play Leovold, so I don't know what to tell you. I'm sorry. Excuse me. Um, I think Mana War is probably better. Bouncing their guy, we can counter it afterwards. Return to Nature is very good. That's a nice sideboard card. Sure, we don't have 
white cards. That's what I really care about. Rancor or Looter? Eh, yeah, Looter's good. We're not really a Rancor deck. Increasing Devotion. Make five one ones. Or if the spell is cast from the graveyard, create ten tokens instead. Nickel Bolas. This is pack three. I do like Rexage. I like Sahili too. You can just play it and keep up uh, for all your 1-1s. One keep up. Uh... Oh, Nifty Chris, what up, my dude? Always a pleasure, my friend. Always a pleasure. I think it's just Rexage. I don't think Sahili's that good. But I love having a Rexage ability. I don't think there's swords in this cube, though. I'm going to take Hinterland Harbor. <clears throat> Are you winning? Chris, I can't tell yet. We have a Leovold. And a Mystic Snake. So I think so. Uh, Chris, you just joined my stream, so... I think I am winning. Do, 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 do. I don't know why I did the, the more you know jam, but... <clears throat> the feels excellent <laughs> we have a hulk <clears throat> yeah we can even discard the echoing card with like looter or Jace, Factor Fiction. There's like several ways to get into the graveyard, which is pretty interesting. <clears throat> Verdant Catacombs is nice. So is Nexus of Fate, though. Verdant only gets a green and a black right now. I also like Eternal Witness. This pack's actually very good. I think it's Nexus of Fate here. Yeah, I'm taking Nexus. That card's busted. God, I love that Cruel Ultimatum is here. Overgrown Tomb? Alright, well. <sighs> I'm taking an Overgrown Tomb. Farseek. We do have Demir Signet too, which is very, very nice. Opt? Actually, maybe it's just Opt here. This actually does get uh, an island and an overgrown tomb. Actually, I'm thinking I'm going to take the Farseek. Llanowar wastes. Now we're talking. We don't have much removal, though. Maybe we just want a Doomblade. Ah, I want the fixing. <laughs> Ulamog. I want to take Traverse. Eh, boring, boring, boring. This pack's pretty bad. I'll just take Is It Signet. Yeah, Sealy came back. Okay. Fleet Wheel Cruiser. <clears throat> nah, none of these cards do anything. Uh, 
What time zone are we in? Mountain Daylight Time. Is that what it's called? So this deck needs one cut. Oh, the Doomblade came back. How nice. So what do we have? We have Overgrown, Land of War, Farseek, Demir Signet. Four black sources. <clears throat> um, I might just take Ancient Stone Idol out. I got a nine creatures. <clears throat> Traverse seems decent. We have Looter. Doom. Let me cast a non creature spell, create a 1 1. It's pretty good. Our deck has a lot of non creature spells. I want to take Ancient Stone Idol out. <clears throat> I think it's just too expensive for us. And probably take out. Maybe wild growth? I, I don't want to cut Jace. Jace is like one of our two planeswalkers. <clears throat> it's it's destroying artifact, enchantment, or a graveyard. It's literally just an upgraded naturalize. Alright, let's... I think one swamp is fine. We get to search for it if we ever get path to exiled. Uh, six, seven, eight, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's actually very good. We we'll get to add one more. Mmm. Mmm. Yes. I guess we'll add another blue. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10. I think that seems correct. Also, Sahili's double double blue, triple blue. Okay, we're going to just play 41. <clears throat> Isn't the Mancer just a bomb in the The Mancer? Ophiomancer? No, Ophiomancer is fine. I think it's good. Oh, I got to land Night Pack Ambusher and make a token? I'm game. Oh, wow. If this hand had one friggin' green source, turn one into turn two. <clears throat> Do we still keep it? I don't know. Probably because we still have Looter and Sensor, and we can still cast Sahili with any land. I think this is fine. I mean, Ophiomancer is the one that makes snakes. Oh my god, there's a mountain in our deck? Come on. Why does it do this? Well, we didn't draw it, so that's good. You gonna counter my looter? Mmm, no. Okay. Oh my god. I hate when they sneak in the lands because of Sahili. I could just add another forest, which is nice. Ugh. Ooh, they missed a the land drop. We, however, shall not. 
Well, we might. <clears throat> we did. Oh, that's so exciting. Um, I guess we're just playing Demir Signet. Okay. Well, it's kind of like not missing land drops. I feel like for it to disregard this as a red card, it has to know what cards you're playing, right? So... Okay, that's pretty good. Hmm. Let's discard that and it just gets shuffled right back in. I'm pretty sure it's in our best interest to put this on... on deck... Give me a land here. <clears throat> Just land. Oh, yes. Oh. <clears throat> so we're going to go one, two. Actually, let's go. We don't need. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we don't need this. And now we don't have to take anything. Sahili, Sahili. <clears throat> we also have Pact of Negation, which is pretty sweet. Oh, they're thinking about it. They are not thinking about it. We can also make a copy of this and play, like, something. That doesn't seem great, though. <clears throat> all right, all right. Ooh. Karasis. One, two, three, four, five... I think I guess we're just playing uh I don't know, they gotta take down Mystic Snake. I guess we can make a copy of Demir Signet. No, we that wouldn't do anything. Yeah, I guess we're just passing here. I mean, like we have no reason to take down Mystic Snake when we got <clears throat> crashing footfalls in the wings. <clears throat> That's what things are for. A tapioca with cheese? What even is that? That sounds wild, dude. Tapioca with cheese? Man, Brazil's wild. Alright. So they thought scoured and for they they okay. They forbid an alchemy and then nothing happened. This guy's coming down next turn. Dang. Oh yeah, look at all the lands I got. So we can go and then we have blue, blue, blue. Yeah, we can just play devoted druid here. Keep up Mystic Snake. And keep up Pact Navigation. I know tapioca pudding. I don't know tapioca like I'm not I'm not familiar with its origins or its default form, you know what I mean? If that player draws a card, if that player is your opponent and has four more cards. I don't like that. No, don't like that. Ooh. 
This is probably the game, right? They're probably just going to be like, I can't. I'm done. I'm going to go to the next game. Days. Wow. Oh, I guess you got me. That was not the end of the game. Let's make some rhinos. Crash on through to the other side. Crash on through to the other side, yeah. The one true sandwich to rule them all. Oh, they got rid of a control magic? At the beginning of your next upkeep, sure. Yeah, there's no way I'm not getting my four my two four fours, my dude. <clears throat> Break on through to the other side. Yeah. I guess there is some way, but not today. Oh, that's pretty sweet. I mean, we lose a thing, right? But one, two, three, four, five, six. We can actually, actually do this. Two, three, four, five, six. It's only a six, six, guys. I guess we could copy Demir Signet and make a seven, seven. Could also kill this. Ow! Ow, ow, ow. So this is what? One, two, three. And then we have one, two, three, four, five, six. So we can actually make a four, four. Choose an artifact you control. Target artifact you control. Uh, choose an artifact or creature. Sure. Add, add, untap, untap, add, add, use this guy, Rex Sage. And we're just making it 5-5, five, five, which survives like a Storm's Wrath in case they have that. You want to counter this? Might have like Sensor. Yep, probably should have played around sensor. Shut up and take my money. Could be miscalculation too. Superfruits, one tapioca cheese buck. Why would you do that? Alan for sixty months, my dude. Thank you. That is wild. All right, we can't play around that. Alan, thank you for the resub. Really appreciate it, my dude. <coughs> I have one true sandwich. Oh, God, don't. Don't do it. Okay. <laughs> Got Metamorph for one rhino. All right. Well, uh, would you like to pay this? Yeah, you know, why not? Uh, one, two remaining. One, two. Sure. Yeah, you know, I think I will. Keep one of these dudes home. Stay home. I guess it doesn't matter because it has trample, so. OK. 
Okay, so if I go you can stay home. Okay. Rhino City. Return to nature. They got Phyrexia Metamorph and Fevered. Oh, we also have Rex Sage, I guess. Is that enough? I don't know. Mountain, get out of here. Add another forest. Beautiful. Beautiful. Eh, return actually seems pretty good, I guess. Hmm. Take out Traverse. Actually, Traverse is good. I don't know. I don't know how high our concentration of uh, different spell types is going to be. Oh, yeah. We're doing it. And we're going to go like this. Oh yeah, we're now we're just crashing footfalls here. Nah, don't be doing that. Are you gonna daze me? No, nah, you just got that that car just went to the trash can. Um I kinda like Farseek for Overgrown and then we can end of turn Nightpack Ambusher. God, Ohio sucks. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, we're just going to play Sublime. Sahili, Sahili. Because next turn, if we far seek, if we draw a land, we can go far seek and looter, or we can go Nightpack Ambusher. Or if we don't hit a land, we can just go far seek. Find Overgrown Tomb. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Make a one one. Do 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 do. Overgrown tomb bay. Would you like to pay two? N no, no, thank you though. I'm good. Did they not do anything? They did absolutely nothing. That's pretty wild. Do, 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 do. It doesn't matter what comes. Well, fresh goes better in life. I got a counter spell in hand. Oh, they're not going to do anything, huh? Well, my dude. We are ambushing. Oh, that just resolved. Wild. Here we go again. <clears throat> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. That was very good. I'm a fan. But here we go. Making a wolf. $5 donation incoming. I'm watching it happen. <clears throat> oh, there he is. Bam. Bam. Little Emerald Lagasse style. Bam! Control magic. I kind of like just letting it happen and bouncing this guy. Like, that seems better than countering this, right? That gives us a great use for Mana War. Land. Mystic Snake -oo. Don't you take my guy. 
Shut up and take my money. That was rude of you. Arctic Avenger 5, our mama Amba sure had a baby, Bugs. <laughs> she sure did. She sure did. Pyroclasm. Okay. Man, ain't nobody care about that. I guess we'll just pass here. Because, you know, counter spells. They got six cards in hand. It's a lot. I'm just going to magma jet my face. I kind of just want to play Ambusher here, but they could still have days. Hmm. Seroquel in the past. I don't even know what that is, actually. I lame bit for two hours just thinking about everything. Not really depressed or overwhelmed, but couldn't switch off. I was supposed to be on it for three months, but I took myself off at three weeks in, and to be honest, I haven't really had the same trouble since, and that was th that's interesting. So the question is, do we just play around a daze here? I think so, because, like, they have to, like, make a thing here, so I'm just gonna... <sighs> if you want a daze, you gotta bounce a land, which is better than, like, yeah, that's fine. We don't have any lands, so... I like that. I got a Rex Sage though, which I also like. Um, take it to the limit one more time. You counter this? That's a West Wild. That's fantastic. Resolves. That was a very interesting Sinister Sabotage. Niv Mizzet again? Oh, Consecrated Sphinx. Yep, that's pretty good. Yeah. If only we had that island a turn sooner. I don't know how to deal with that. Oh boy. We do not have great ways to deal with that guy. Yep. I mean, it's only turn 11. We only missed six land drops, so. <laughs> Not like I'd want to hit all six of them, but, you know, a few would be nice. Show me a sign. Take it to the limit. One more time. Leo is in the deck. Oh, good. I forgot about that. <laughs> e awkward. Guess we'll discard Return to Nature. They can draw two more. Maybe they'll deck themselves. I mean, they're at seven. Sure. I don't know what's going on right now. This is wild. Hmm.
It's all coming together. I don't know what two mana counter spell you could have here. Miscalculation? Logic not for three. So if we counter this, we still get a Mystic Snake, which is nice. Oh, we can just condescend this for one, can't we? And we get an extra two guys this turn. Seems good. Um, bottom you, put you on top. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, we should have just kept the land too, huh? Yeah, that would have been good. So now they block here. They take one, two, three, four, five, six. They go to one. Oh, that's rough. Dang it, we messed up. No attacks, huh? Okay. <laughs> I'll take the Doomblade pile, my dude. Uh, choose this one. Around the time we didn't know how to deal with Consecrated Sphinx. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, this is just game. <laughs> nah, brah. Don't bring a force of negation to a pact of negation fight. Yep, got him. Woo, Consecrated Sphinx. That card sucks. <laughs> Alright, let's actually change this mountain out to a forest. The Gotham's are so real, dude. What would you do for a Klondike bar? Ba -ding -ding. That card sucks. How many rounds are these? Three. They are three rounds. Oh yeah, snap keep. Snap it off. God gravy, that's a good mana. That's a good amount of mana. Good, that's a good mana. We actually could have played Forest Wild Growth on here. Tap this to make this. Yeah, we missed it. We missed a land last turn. A mana, if you will. Well, that's no good for us now. Um, let's play Swamp. Wild Growth on here. I guess we'll just attack for two. Unexciting, but. Such is what you do with seven available mana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll have eight next turn, though, so we can cast literally anything in our deck. <laughs> Poops. Oh, they got the Traverse? I guess they're playing a, a base black deck, so that doesn't really scare them much. Oh, wow. This is wild. Now I only have six mana on turn four. Seven mana. Okay, well, hopefully they don't have anything exciting. Don't play an Obnixilis, that would be the, just the worst. Okay, that's a card. 
no one actually cares about. Let's remember to take Doomblade out. Let's remember to take Doomblade out. Get an island here. Um, good grief. We're going to play lands because if we draw like Hydroid Crassus and we hit a land off of that, we want to play that land too, so. Oh, good. Good, good, good. Solid. Okay. Might as well kill your goat. Oh, they didn't even scry. Good value. Good value. Hydroid Crassus ain't even good here. Man, this hand was great up until the point where we drew nothing. If only we had a companion deck. Now we'd have a companion we can play. Mana War. Man of War. What are you doing? Don't tell me how to live my life. Dang. It's confusing. How did Frank respond? He's straining right now. I responded to a comment Chris made on Facebook, and Chris was like, How did he do that? Caldra, have a good night, buddy. That token didn't have a family. This is seven damage. Some people don't like scrying, you know? What are you going to do? One, two. There's a lot of mana, but we don't have anything else to do with it is the problem, so I kind of want to, like... Hope we draw something good. Okay, so, uh, target player's top two, draw a card. Mill you. Shahili. That's not, that's not gonna do it. Okay, Doomblade has to come out. It's terrible. Oh, wow, then they're like, I don't even care about Jace, man. I'm just gonna fucking murder you. And I'm like, oh, Jesus. Oh, goodbye, Sahili. Play something else, yeah. And then I'll draw my languish. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh. Cool story, bro. Oh, it's a yikes for me, dog. Doomblade is hot trash. This actually does seem like a decent... This seems like a decent Ophiomancer matchup. Is Rexage going to be any good? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, Dad. B -b -b Butterfree! Um... Yeah, alright. We definitely need some lands for this hand, but... I think we can do it. I believe in us. Buh, speak to me, Butterfree. I'm okay, Dad. <laughs> Chris, can you tell she, Chris, that uh, I'm okay, Dad? Oh, man, Chris, we need to go back to BlizzCon. That was a fucking blast, dude. Boo, doo, boo. Why do I have Cruel Summer by Banana Rama stuck in my head, guys? Fuck, I don't know how I get any of these songs stuck in my head. The Butterfree effect. <laughs> That's a solid effect. Oh, Cultivators, come on, Neil. Oh, you're going to do something else. Uh, sure. Not great. God, even to play Jace Cultivator's Caravan just kills it if they have a three power creature. I mean, it's 100% condescend. It's not even close. 
Surprisingly, you can hit three of our cards, though. Oh, and then there's nothing to do. That's pretty bad. I also received a disappointed look. Checks out. Oh, is it just going to kill Sealy? All their creatures have three power, so it's pretty bad. It is a vicious cycle, dude. You're not kidding. Uh, where's my Rex Sage now? All right. I mean, I would also take a fourth mana, fourth land. Show me that smile again. Show me that smile. Don't waste another minute on super friends. Do -do 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 -do. The best is ready to be good. Whoa! whoa. God, I play Go 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 Sing it in Car uh, Cultivator's Caravan, and I'm like, well, I wonder if they have anything to to wreck Sage. You stupid idiot. Yep, we're just gonna concede this game. Like, if you can't hit a fucking third, fourth land on turn six, like it's just you're just not playing the same game as your opponent. So. I'm going to send you pictures of awful sandwiches. You already do that. Joke's on you. <laughs> you can't show me anything worse than what my eyes have already seen. Lorifix. Good games in the sense that I could not hit a fourth land. And I could not hit any, any cards that did anything in game one. But otherwise, yes, good games. Other than those facts that made them bad games. Good games. But they were not GG's. They were BG's. What are you going to do? Magic's tough. Sometimes it's turn six and you can't hit a fourth land. Sometimes it's game one and all you do is hit lands and you can't hit any spells that you can cast. These are the decisions we've... Chosen? That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> they were the G of G's. They were the B G's. I will keep this hand. What is this thing? A thought sponge? Wild. Wild. I am easy prey after all, so I have no one to blame but myself. I will daze your mental note. Discard Fallen Shinobi? That card's in here? Fantastic. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, man. Look at all these things that they're doing. This is just, just crazy. Woo! As long as you got each other, we got the world spinning right in our heads. I'm playing Baffle Strix. Their deck seems great so far. Fallen Shinobi, Chubacomber, and Baffle Strix. They have all the cards that I want to have. They're going to play Bone Shredder here. I'm going to attack first. I like attacking before I cast my Bone Shredders. Though now that I've dealt damage, I will trigger my bloodthirst. Victim. I am dead inside.
Well, do we let them get a hit? Play Crisis for two. Draw a card. Do we end of turn factor? They still have six cards in hand. Like, they're going to untap with more cards in their hand than we have. It's so, that's fucking wild. Like, you hit, like, you have to hit these, you hit these two guys off mental note and have victimize in hand, and you hit Baleful Strix on turn two. Like, I don't know, man. I don't know. And I have two, I have two counter spells right here that would have, like, that's fucking wild, dude. That's so crazy. I'm just, like, trying to, like, wrap my brain around it, I guess. Yeah, that's that's incredible. Guess what? Blocking here. Come on, show me Man of War. Show me that smile again. I'm not doing it. Don't play Gonti. That was like an X spell. I'm sure it's like Mind Twist. Oh, just Sea Gray. Ha <laughs> ha! We did it! Hi! Oh, I guess they could just ninjutsu it out though, right? Yeah, alright. This guy's too fucking good, dude. He's too good! So if we bounce this... We block here, they just bounce Tassig or put Fallen Shinobi into play, and we, there's no real way to deal with that. Oh, boy. Another situation where Doomblade looks terrible. Alright. Doomblade looks terrible. I'm bringing Return to Nature and Ophiomancer in, though, that's for sure. I'm going to take out the Rexage again, because it didn't look like there was a ton of stuff here, but... Oh, boy. This is a quick one-two, boys. What can you do? Dude, it's so cold in here right now. Pack looks bad? I don't I don't think so. I mean, just because they happen to get victimized on like turn three, like I mean being able to counter their spells in the late game is usually always good. Yes. Um yeah, you know what? Oh, we have no blue. That's that's the catch. I was like, yeah, what's this this hand is great. What could possibly go wrong? Oh wait. I figured it out. It's okay, we'll hit a blue. It's an island right on the top. I don't know what you guys are worried about. Preordain's very, very good. Hunter was just like, Ehh. yeah, I like the the blue black tempo deck a lot. I feel like we did reasonably well with it in the first game, and then we splashed green. Kind of like the opposite of blue. Three blue cards. No blue mana. Let's yield until the end step. Okay, two lands, sure.
Tassir is pretty good here. Murderous cut our wild. It's fucking triple blue card. Oh lord. We have like 10 blue sources in the deck, just to be clear. We have more blue sources in this deck than you would in a regular draft deck that was running 8-9. They just hard casted that ninja. That's pretty funny. I mean, not as funny as our draws. That ghost is giving that old man a terrible haircut. What is that? What? What are you saying right now? What's happening? Yep. This is ridiculous. Uh, no, we have more than one forest. We have one swamp, though. So. I mean, a bounty board would be cool, but it's hard to... Someone would have to pick them out, you know what I mean? Like, someone would have to be like, this is what you gotta do. Like, you're, anybody's welcome to do that. I have no problem with you guys supporting me in that way. The blue card in their graveyard? Oh. <laughs> uh, that ghost is giving that old man a terrible haircut. It's true. I personally don't trust my... Personal hygiene to ghosts, but oh, another blue card. I'm just gonna concede, guys. It's got no point where like it's just not worth playing this out. Um, but let's take a look real quick. And um, turn to details, view the deck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and a Demir Signet and a Far Seek. That's eleven sources of blue. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven blue sources. And black sources? One, two, three, four. <laughs> and we drew two of them. So, or one of them? I think we drew Av My Coast in a Swamp, right? So we do two of four black sources, zero of eleven blue sources. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on twitch.tv slash frankblorb. Manatraders.com, CoolStuffInc.com. Links and promo codes are all down below. Be sure to slam those like and subscribe buttons, guys. Patreon.com slash FranklinPoreGrave to spend $1 or $2 a month and support the channel. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.